<laughs> last game was great. They made the uh, SMD in their firebase, and then uh, one person in the team made a stealth tier 3 navy in a corner, made the nukes up, and put it behind their base. Uh, So they have Cybron and it is uh, one Yeah, that's like a thing you can say, oh, you're totally going to do this and hope they don't do the, the best strategy. Instead of justifying your gameplay, you should do something with the mess. Go, go, go. Oh, that radar system is... They do have a siren. Need to be careful for Jester. It's also weirdly placed AA. Uh -huh. Boomer. Wow, <laughs> actually that's uh, <laughs> um, it in the base. I'm one, I'm the one with just three NGs here. Yeah. 
way too much damage. I think it should not have done that much damage. by attempted what are you saying yeah you guys he's not going to catch that neither is mine and they're pretty creepy because have a counter pd the fuck Green is walking back to his base. Can you make tanks in the base? What can I make in the base? Tanks? Yes, to protect Green so he can be at the front. Okay. So, yeah, okay. You want to go there too? Um, no, I want to stay mobile. If I go take two, I feel um, I might miss out on something. I was actually thinking about missiles. Um, careful, you're running into tier two PD fire. Uh, he's overshooting and reaching us. The creeping really hard. Your ASU is in the way of my PD. Sorry, hurrying out. Still in this blocking shots mode. Firebase there is going to be a problem. Uh, why is he getting gun? They have too much defense there. I get the thirty power here. Wait, they're too naval. Yep. Gonna fuck them over. 
Yeah, actually, Salem are good if there is no RT yet. They are always good. Uh, I'm gonna put them in a transporter and place them on land so they can walk. <laughs> XD, uh, transport, drop, drop. To be coming to your base, Vanguard. Air here. Just go. Oh. <laughs> wow. Bringing up Scots so they look like transports the new strategy. So your navy is definitely scouted. Your P3 is done soon. Oh, wow, we have played in zero in Dell on their base and shit. <laughs> oh, so bad. Uh. He's restun, you should start ravaging. Okay. Salem's are rolling on soon. I don't have enough energy though. Okay, I'm trying to get a T2 energy as well. Commander under attack. What the hell? How far is your tier 2? Wait, what? Where is it? You mean uh, tier 2 SEU? No, yeah, well, T2 energy, whatever. However, I also have T2 factory, so. Yeah, but you didn't start the energy yet, right? No. Oh, it's kind of what but it I sounds like now. when you say that. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Just get the ravagers! Yeah. Okay, if you have spare mass, I can put it in two depths. Also making another juice. It's not clear to this one if uh, they pull all their eco.
what fighting bomber against uh, Salem? I see that every day. What's uh, check, uh, check south, dude. Um, I don't have the two in the area, so I cannot do anything about it. We have a Sam at the front. We are um, getting the bases getting bombed too. We need anti air in the base right now. Uh, yeah, then make flag with the tier 2 engines that you have. Yeah, I'm already on it. Yeah, that shield. Eco. I'll have a nice eco because I don't have a shipyard anymore. Uh, Can you upgrade the radar in front to T2? Sure, upgrade it. Ships. It's got to if they make a if we run into a monkey that's going to be fail. Oh, oh I just went over their base. F. What from uh, green? 
Ja, Indo. What you going to make with the navy in the third tree? Battle jeeps. Okay. I'm starting anti new consent. Right, I suppose that's safe given that we have two navy. Uh, So this is our game to win for sure. Um, battleship. What's the range on the starting ones? One hundred twenty-eight. Uh, I think so. Be aware that this yeah. is the same range as the RT they have. Yeah, but artillery only has two thousand hit points, and battleships have trillion health hit points. Plus, we should really get more radar in center, so upgrade it to T3, because um, otherwise they will still be able to bomb us and shit. I do not have enough energy for that yet. Um, I don't have the three engines in the base yet. Uh, upgrade it and give it to me, or give it to me and I'll upgrade it. that uh, one energy is missing there. Next to the radar. One SMD. I 
And if you have spare mouse, I can use it to finish my max upgrades. Get you 4,000 mil. Oh wow, cool. I also have um, things ready, so I'm leaking 5k and Overflowing or what? Yeah, of course. Just did the big tier G scout. We really need to. Did, did I miss green scouting or did he not scout at all? He scouted with ASF, um, so the base is relatively up to date. They don't have anything dangerous and are still in equipping. <clears throat> now they saw my battleship, so they will know what's going on. I don't know how they will react to that. Oh my god, look at Rat, he has, if he has no shielding and TMD there, this is going to be boom. Let it be boom. Oh my god, shit, he just made TMD. Bah. Right, if I had been paying attention to me, uh... already have six Sam's um, queued in front. Okay. Just one then. Battleship is ready, I'm going to bombardment mode. Where is the evil love I was hoping for? Oh they have a few drug bombers but uh Oh, now they have one last. Wow, are they bombing into the wall on the land? Yeah, sometimes they, they do that, absolutely. You need a very straight vector for those torpedoes to work, and the stupid high mountains, they are not in your favor. I love how they scout us all day long, but um, don't get anything to attack us with. Um, your battleship is going to the other side? Yeah, yeah, sure. Um, it will arrive on roughly on time with the second one, so I'll start bombarding from two sides. Yeah, okay. This way, if he gets torpedo bombers, whatever, he needs to disperse his attack. You just have 33 gunships. Um... Is green making tier 2 tanks? Maybe dropping? I'm getting us a spider in front for uh, surprise attacks from the front. If you want, you can help me build it. Putting drones on it. They're, they're taking ships killed my cruiser. Yeah. Um, well, I suppose Green's SF will hopefully cover your battleship if it gets attacked with fire to shit. Yeah, just get a few shield boats for your cruisers. You are you, yeah, aren't you? Um, I'm talking about your battleship, which you sent to the side where there are no cruisers. Eh, I'm hoping Green will wake up in time. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh. Actually, I'm not so sure about these trades. Oh, what's this? 
There is something in the water on the left. Oh, they're making a uh, What are they building? Harms? Suppose so. Well, that or could be more be experimental. They have a vision center. I would not be surprised if they make an RT soon. But let's see, what do they have? They have just a one ravager. Yeah, we, we can totally break that. Okay, so bombardment is um, undergoing, and this is about max range battleships. Mm, or getting hit by RT there. Ah, don't, don't make more cruisers. I can make cruisers. Uh, they are. The F1s are so much better on this map than the second ones. Yeah, that's true. Then again, I want a few ones to have sitting around. Okay, so what am I gonna do next with the Mars? How about I'm gonna get us yeah, some super artillery? <laughs> I knew it. Sure, go for it. Why not? Oh. Okay, I built the trillion shields for the thing. What's that? Oh, they have a fat boy. Is the wow? <laughs> okay, I'm reclaiming your energy storage that's next to the SMT. <laughs> yeah, sure, I don't need it. Or oh, you can ground fire maybe the base we get. Actually, that's a big waste of time just to deny some navy. Uh, mm, big waste yeah. of resources. Like the the navy version of uh, making an RT base. Drops coming in on the right. What's that? Fat boy. Just top you the bombers. I can put it just uh, attack missile the support is you building uh, this shit there. Careful your battleships, one of them is shooting at the walls. Yeah, but he's running out of viable targets. This is why I wanted to go to the other side, which I cannot hit anymore due to denial due to arms.
we can ground fire the harm, I think. The visible one. Um, I'm pretty sure this water's too deep. They did a fix for that, which is really annoying in Phantom, and not all of them can be hit anymore. Oh, okay. So the harms before was like floating at 30 meters depth or something, and now they go to the really to the ground of the floor. Plus, ground fire is so shitty, honestly. Worst mechanic ever. Jeez, so much air not scouting. They have gunships and they have an RT that's done. And it's going after the Skatis, looks like. No? Going after the SMD. Yeah, well, if they get to nuke it, then. Problem that if it gets to this kind of game and one person is not contributing, then they have more moss, of course. Oh, I actually got moss. Okay. Oh, almost power stalls. Ah shit, they're going after my SMD in the base. Yeah, which doesn't make any sense because the thing in front is still loaded and they don't have nukes up. Yeah, fuck, all my mechs are dying. Yeah, that's a bigger problem. Commander under attack. I don't have build power there. I'm trying to spam T2 shields up to your base. But uh, the Skatis is nearly finished and then I can pummel that artillery. So make sure the Skatis doesn't die or is GG. Oh come on! Commander under attack. What? Because he's 700 and has no idea what he's doing. Okay, 
Okay, um, do you have T3R? No, you don't, right? I don't have T3R. So yes, I can scout. Okay, um, I'm... Okay, otherwise I'm just gonna spam T1 air scouts and do a scouting run over the base now. I don't need the mess for anything else right now. I can use it. Sure. Well, I mean, I'm, yeah, yeah, sure. I'm, I'm giving you a few of my makes so I don't have to transfer all the time. Okay, cool. So, have a little. And looks like the RT is done. Nice. That's pretty much GG then. Um, I'm gonna try to go for the nuke bases next. Jeez, my cruisers are still getting killed by gunships while we have like a hundred ESF. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what he's doing. They are going for the SMT in Green's base. I yeah, but they have two nuke launchers. But we have lots of, we have all the anti nukes we need. If it doesn't get destroyed, just keep it safe, we got it. They have two. Oh, yeah. Uh, so oh, that is, only is close to his SMD. Add some energy storages. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you cannot you cannot shield against the scarces. That's it. Okay, this is the second time uh, that we became the cancer. How does it feel to be cancer vanguards? All gaps follow this formula. If you cannot break it in the early game, you always will have to stand up game. And it's just boring as fuck, even to me, and I'm just a thousand noob. I think often you can break it. Um, the thing the, is, the, if the, they go the with problems, the RT the problem base... Is, the problem is you have no advantage for breaking it. In settings, if you break a position, whatever, you gain mass, uh, you gain an advantage, you gain a bombardment position. This one, if you break it, the game is either over, but if you fail, it becomes immediate counterproductive because you basically dump mass in front of their base. And it's not like a battlefield where it's contested, they automatically have it. So there's no benefit to pushing in a gap match. None whatsoever, because either the game is over or you give the game to them. So pushing in a gap map is really stupid. I seriously disagree. So for instance, one thing that I did is uh, push with cruisers and they spent a lot of resources in making turbombers bombers and TMD. Um, and I've seen a lot of games where land pushes worked and so on and um, yeah of course if you just run in with one spider or something and it dies that's a mass donation but that's how such attacks work on most maps uh, you need to have something to follow up with yeah, yeah obviously i get what you're saying applying pressure in some kind of things is good because you cause the enemy to expend resources yourself whatsoever but honestly cruisers are a standoff tactic this is what i mean by pushing um so my argument is still valid because cruisers are not pushing you are still stand or you're getting a standoff and if they die you do not dump mass in front of them this is what i mean by pushing if you even get bombers um, you can target them, but there's still the risk of uh, it going wrong and dumping mass in front of the enemy base. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, with UEF you don't have beyond... You can do um, tier 3 land spam, but that doesn't... That could not work in this game because of the gunships they had then, or air player. Um, yeah. I think a lot of games, like... The ones we did with uh, Sofli, <laughs> well, there the attack is quite late, but 
I mean, this is like that attack happens at 20 minutes. This is at 40 minutes, right? Uh, the thing with UF is that if they make an RT base, which is what people often do on this map, I actually think it's a, a bad idea if it if you invest a lot of mods in it. It counters Fat Boy, and that leaves UF with no experimentals to do anything with, right? I mean, the only land experimental they have is countered. They don't have air experimental. But if you make some chickens or something, a lot of the time, I think, if you spam them up and you try to scout the eye a bit, then you can just run in and kill shit because people are not expecting it. And if they're just going tier 3 RT, that's so many resources that if you put this island land, then you should be able to break through. But of course, if you have one player that's not doing shit, then they can have one player equivalent that's just making ravagers and then you will get countered. Yeah, 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 sure, obviously. I mean, any any time you get um, to a player to simply echo and you win basically by two versus three in, and that echo player can just get the big guns out, obviously that's an advantage for the team. That's why what's what, basically what we did with soft. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what was nice about these games is that they never got to like the day three RT point like this one. They were always over in 25 minutes. Yeah, exactly. And this is why when 